class. So today we're going to continue our study of The Diary of a Young Girl by Anne Frank. And so today we're going to be covering different character traits that you can find in a character. So what I thought of today is that I made a profile page that kind of resembles a profile page you can find on social media, such as with Facebook or MySpace or other social media websites. And so here's our profile page. And I decided that we should do one on our main character of our book, which is Anne Frank. So, as you can see, I have her name, her birthday, and her occupation, which in the diary she's in hiding, so that's why she's in hiding. And she lives in Amsterdam in the secret attic, and, but she's actually from Frankfurt, Germany. And I also have her family listed, her mother, her father, and her sister Margot. So for the About Me section of her profile, what we're going to do is um, think of some different traits that can describe Anne Frank, and then we're going to make a paragraph of it in the end. So I put a few examples on the board, and the first example I have is determined. Because Anne Frank is very determined, because even though she's living a life of fear, she still is determined to revise her diary and redo her work so she can make it better, so that she dreams of becoming a writer and a journalist. I also have brave because she never gave up even though she was living a life of fear and was in danger every day that she was living in hiding. Okay, so who can tell me a couple other traits that she could have? Hopeful. Hopeful, yes, that's right. She was very hopeful. She was very hopeful because even though things weren't working out and you know the war was going on, she still always remained hope that she would make it out alive and can still continue on her dreams. Uh, Emily, do you have a quote? Um, yes, ma'am. Um, outgoing because she likes to meet the other people. That's very right. She was very happy when the other family came to stay with her too. Okay, uh, Dylan, do you have a trait? Stubborn because she was bad and no one would listen. That's right. She always got irritated when people didn't listen to her. She felt like they didn't understand her. Okay, so these are all really good traits, and thank you for this. So what we're going to do is we're going to write a paragraph describing your personality. And I thought of some other things that you can remember when you're writing your paragraph to describe a character's traits. First off, you have the character's likes, their dislikes, their concerns, their hopes, their and their relationships with their family and their friends. And you can think of all of these things when you're determining their, char their different character traits. And I actually came up with a saying that we can use to remember this. And it actually has something to do with Bad drawing of a duck. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe later we can try that. Okay, so actually, if you'll notice out the L, the D, the C, the H, the F, and another F, the first the, are the first letters of these different things. But it can also spell out a secret message, which can be little. Ducks can have funny faces. And if you'll see, it also has the L, the D, the C, the H, the F, and the F for likes, dislikes, concerns, hopes, and their relationships with friends and family. So I wonder if we can all say this together. Little, little, little ducks can have funny faces. faces. That's very good. Now, can we say all this together? Likes, dislikes, concerns, hopes, family, friends. And I know this is, these are a, few, a couple different words to remember. So one way we can remember is to kind of sing it. So you can kind of say, little ducks can have funny faces. Little ducks can have funny faces. So, do you guys want to sing it with me? Yeah. Little ducks can have funny faces. Very good. And so, if you can remember this phrase.
phrase, little ducks can have funny faces, you can also remember the likes, dislikes, concerns, hopes, family, and friends. And if you think about all these things in a character, you can help identify their character traits. 